Good morning, dear students. How are you? Today we are going to start our new lesson and the first lesson in the second term. It's solving two equations of first degree in two variables graphically. Okay, how we can solve it? First of all, if we have 2x plus 4 equal 8. What is this? This is an equation, but this equation has how many variables? Only one variable, which is x. And from which degree? It's from the first degree. If we want to solve it, what we are going to do? 2x equal 8 minus 4. So, 2x equals 4 and x equals what? 2x equals 8 minus 4. 2x equals 4. So, x equals 2 to find the variable. The second one, x plus y equals 3. This is also an equation, but has how many variables? Two variables, x and y. How we can solve this equation? We can solve it by what? We said before, 0, 1, 2, the number of mobinil, and we can solve it graphically. Substitute x with 0 and find y in each time, and you will find a straight line. Now we have two equations. 2x plus y equals 0, and x plus 2y equals 3. We want to solve the two equations together to find the, vari the variable x and y. Okay? First, what we will do, we will solve the first equation 2x plus y. How? By 0, 1, 2. Graphically, first you are going to put y, king, so y equals negative 2x. Then, substitute by the table 0, 1, 2. If we put x equals 0, you will find y equals 0. If x equals 1, with the calculator, you will find that y equals negative 2. If x equals 2, then y equals negative 4. Then we are going to plot it in the Cartesian coordinates. 0, 0, then 1 and negative 2, then 2 and negative 4. This is the first straight line, line number 1. Any point in the straight line, we, it will satisfy the equation, okay? Okay, what about the other equation, x plus 2y equal 3? You are going to put y as a king, so it will be 3 minus x over 2. Then you are going to substitute by 0, 1, 2, and then plot. When you plot the second line, there is an intersection. This is our intersection. The intersection of the two points, this is the solution set of the two equations together. What is the solution set here? Negative 1 and 2. So we must write the solution set between braces, okay, and between two, between ordered pair, because we have x and we have y. So our solution set is negative one and two. If I ask you how many, or how, the number of solution set, how many solution set do you have? You have only one solution set. Take care, the solution set is not like the number of solution set. Another example, you have 3x plus y equals 4. Also, put y as a king, so 4 minus 3x, and then substitute by the table 0, 1, 2. The other uh, equation is 2y plus 6x equals 3. You want only y, so first 2y equals 3 minus 6x. But because you have here 2 and you don't want this, it will go by the other uh, uh, it's multiplication, so it will go with division, okay? Then plot, but, uh, also 0, 1, 2, and you will find y. Let's plot line L1 and line L2. Line L1, 0, 4, 1, and 1, and the last is 2 and negative 2. The second equation, it will be 0, 1, and, one and a half, 1, and negative 2, 2, and negative 4.5. Look at the two straight lines, L1 and L2. Where is the intersection? 
there is no intersection. That means that there is no solution set. So the solution set here is phi. When line one will be parallel to line two, so the solution set is phi. What about the number of solution set? Huh? There is a number of solution set. The solution set here is zero. Okay? The last example is 3x plus 2y equals 6 and y equals 3 minus 3 over 2x. Here, y is a king already, so you can substitute with 0, 1, 2 and find and plot the line. What about the second equation? 2y equals 6 minus 3x. I don't want 2, I will divide divide it 2. Look at this equation and this equation. The two equations are equal. So the same straight line, if you want to plot L1 and if you want to plot L2, they will be on the same straight line. That means that any point will satisfy the equation. That any point here is a solution set. So that means that L1 and L2 are coincident. Coincident, okay? What about the solution set? We can write the solution set equal between braces, order pair x and y, such that y equal the equation equal 3 minus 3 over 2x. If I ask you about the number of solution set, you will say that infinite number of solution set because this is a straight line, okay? This is the three types of the solution set in this lesson. Maybe it will be one solution set when they are intersecting at one point, like what we see, uh, say before, or maybe there is no solution set when they are parallel, and the last one when they are the same straight line, so infinite number of solution set. So we have here two nodes. If L1 parallel to L2, that means that L1 intersect L2 equals what? Phi. Then the slope of L1 equals the slope of L2. But we can find, or we can know, the answer without solving. How? If the first equation is AX plus BY equals C, and the second equation is AX plus BY equals C dash. What's the meaning of this? That means that the two equations are equal. But the difference is the constant. When the constant is different and the equation is equal, we will know that the solution set is phi. But when L1 is congruent to L2, this is the coincidence, then the slope of L1 equals the slope of L2. That means that the, the first equation will be equal to the second equation, like what we see it before in the, the last example. Look. The equation equal the second equation. So so they are equal because of that of this we will say that the solution set is any any number or any ordered pair will satisfy what? The equation or the uh, the two equations together. Okay? I hope you understand your homework is page two, three, four in your booklet. And at the end of the week, I'm going to uh, write for you the model answer. Thank you.